video online one of the use of the of the layer is to be able to toggle them off and uh, anyway you don't really need this line because you know it's a 640 so the middle is here and uh, vertically it's uh, 248 believe here so it's in the no what is the size oh it's a uh, 800 by uh, oh yeah 800 by 600 so it's uh, uh, 400 and 300 okay this one is good enough <coughs> by default you set the on text uh, to invisible invisible and when you here instead of writing and in the debug you set the and text to visible visible okay so here you should have the neon platformer working with some extra stuff we had it during the week and text <laughs> text and okay and and okay HUD, I log the HUD. Uh, let's see. Let me compare with the other one. Uh, in the other one, I had uh, more. Oh. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> I was uh, wondering if it was, uh, if everything was on the right layer. Uh, on the other game, I made m uh, a bit more uh, work. I did a bit more work on uh, on game uh, level design. That's your job. You have something you can design with now. Uh, yes, a slight little thing I added in uh, my pickup object just to make them a little bit more uh, interesting to look at. I uh, just added uh, two behavior, two sine or sine behavior. Uh, where are you sign? So one for vertical movement with a period of seven, a period of set of four, and a magnitude of two, and another with another sign behavior horizontal vertical horizontal with 5 as a period 2 as a magnitude so the same as the other one and period of set 4 uh, oh offset random haha <laughs> so it will uh, be yeah exactly that uh, a period of set of plus or minus four. The the ID here, just to uh, to make sure you understand, the ID is to have uh, a kind of floating pickup. Let me show you what it does. It's really subtle. Let me check something. I think yeah. It's subtle because it's uh, the pickup itself is way too big. I reduced the size of the pickup in uh, in the game, uh, which was about this size. So I will reproduce the same settings for all my health pickup. And now you should notice a bit more the the floating aspect. It's really, really subtle. But the fact that um, the period is um, is different and the offset is d is uh, randomi randomized, you will have a, f a randomized floating. If you have the same period on both, you could have this effect going just uh, up and up and down uh, diagonally. 
so you have to have uh, something more different don't know why I didn't use period random but uh, I think it's to avoid uh, ending up with the diagonal effect I prefer setting them myself so alright you have this and you just have to can I copy no to do the same here so here you have a little uh, copy and paste uh, ugly copy and paste uh, I leave you uh, with uh, the challenge if you want to uh, blend uh, the two in one uh, single object or maybe you know I don't have coins in my game so uh, I didn't do it but there's some ways to you can achieve this uh, so I let I will let you try it yourself you can uh, ask in the in the subreddit if you have problems if you can't find if you tried something but it didn't work we can talk about why it didn't work and uh, help you to find the solution so yeah same uh, same ugly repetition four and two it's really a problem to do this because if you want to change something globally you can't also I will just change the graphics just to look more like a coin but uh, oh I didn't keep my uh, my pick color uh, you can try making a way better coin display maybe it could be something else since uh, coin isn't really futuristic so maybe something more uh, bluish with uh, I don't know maybe if I erase with the hardness of zero I can have a little uh, orb shape uh, 48 mm, weird yeah why not why not and uh, okay and it's a bit too big so what happened oh yeah just have to uh, select everything and scale it down so now you have nice pickups and uh, I think since they look a bit too dull you can set them to additive no didn't do any good yeah. <laughs> what happened what happened is that I only changed the the behavior on one so uh, let me double check it's vertical vertical seven four two five four two let's me check the health oh yeah same issue vertical seven four two five four Okay. Chuk, chuk, chuk. I I don't like uh, the look of them too much. Maybe one thing I could do is maybe this. Why not? Graphical uh, research now. Maybe maybe it could be something like a crystal ball, a pearl. It's in. 
and uh, sometimes the pearl has no it's good enough like this mm, doesn't look really good uh, that's the my artistic side is crying so I'm trying to uh, satisfy it doesn't look like it will be satisfied let's try this let's try a little uh, how to say a little um, no no yeah it doesn't look too bad it's um Lose my word, uh, an optical illusion. Looks like a crystal thing, should at least, but it's not. Hmm. I wish I had layers. Let's try a cut, then uh, something 32. Okay, here, and then I could do something like this. That's weird. Okay, something like this, and then paste the old thing now. doesn't really look good so yeah I think uh, I don't know yeah I will keep the old version okay so here you have some uh, kind of crystals I think it would be better with the same size uh, coins Mm, a bit too much. Same visual size. Crap. Up. Okay. <coughs> All right. Okay, okay, okay. So now it's not uh, really coins, it's more where is our coin text? Pick up uh, here. Let's call that crystal and uh, rename coins to crystals. can invent any stories behind this maybe you would want to instead of writing the word crystal to have a crystal here in the HUD but not a crystal itself but a clone of the object because you don't want the event to be uh, used for it here then here and here you probably want the text to be on top of it center 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 here text on top something like that maybe 
the so it's not super visually al it's uh, it's aligned but uh, visually it doesn't look really good uh, doesn't look, look really good 